What's up guys, it's Tank Griffin here, and I'm doing a top 5 GameCube games uh, video. Um, I'm going to mention an honorable mention that did not make my cut, and that is NFL Blitz 2003. It's my honorable mention didn't make my cut because I'm not a football fan. But despite that, it's a great game because you get to hit your opponent while he's down and not get penalized for it. So there you go. Now the top 5. <clears throat> Number 5 is True Crime New York City. Now I know it says Xbox on it. Because when I first got the game, I got it for the Xbox, but inside is a GameCube disc. So there you go. But this game was a follow. This game was a follow up to uh, True Crime Streets of L.A., which True Crime Streets of L.A. is still my favorite, but this is just as good. So there you have it. Number four is WWE Day of Reckoning. Um, this game is basically SmackDown versus Raw for the GameCube. Um, it has all the songs from SmackDown vs. Raw, the first one, and it has all the characters from SmackDown vs. Raw. And whenever I'm in my WWE phase and I need a game to play, I usually play this. If I'm in my Attitude Era kind of thing, or I'll play WWF New Mercy. This is definitely one of the best wrestling games I've ever played. The mechanics in the game, in case you're wondering, is like WWF No Mercy, but it looks like they tried upgrading them a little bit, but it's still a great game, nonetheless. None, uh, number three is Enter the Matrix. Now, people at home are probably watching this going, yeah, right. Well, honestly, yeah, I'm, tr I'm being serious because this game is some of the most fond memories as a kid is playing Enter the Matrix. My favorite, le my top two favorite levels is the first level, the post office, where you got to go and retrieve the package, and the other one is the one on the roof where you're trying to escape Agent Smith and the cops. So it's definitely a favorite. Number two is Sonic Riders. Now Sonic Riders is a racing game where you're on like surfboards almost and you compete in a, in a race. I mean it's a great game but honestly with no offense to Sega I should have bought Sonic uh, Adventure 2 Battle. I think that game I looked at it and I passed it up and I bought this instead. I'm probably going to get you know I'm probably going to get some hate for it but I don't care. Haters make me famous. And, uh, but it's still a great game. It's still, I mean, if you want a good racing game, you want a good challenging racing game, this is definitely one to buy. And number one is Mario Party 4. Now, the only reason why this is number one, some of my fond mem childhood memories was playing Mario Party 4 on the GameCube. My favorite, one of my favorite mini games is the three throw where you're throwing the uh, basketballs into the hoops trying to see who can get the most in. Another favorite of mine is the Great Deflate, the two versus two minigame where you gotta deflate like a big kinda inflatable uh, one of those brick things and you know you gotta pound, you gotta keep uh, hitting the ground pound, you gotta hit A twice and it's, it's one of the greatest, greatest games ever played so it's definitely a favorite and always will be. So that's it, and I hope you guys enjoyed this video, and I will be back with more videos. Take care.